Welcome to all the great Jaguar Jones fans. I trust you've all fully recovered from the incident now that the class action lawsuit has been settled. Now, remember, in the settlement, the Jaguar Jones Institute will not be paying attorney's fees or be paying for any fines for crimes you committed while still under the influence of whatever the hell it was that was in my punch bowl. Now that we have that out of the way, we can move on to new business. As the title of this audiovisual digital transmission indicates, old JJ has had his ass pwned pretty damn good. The intellectual powerhouse known as No Point to This One has introduced a size 12 steel toed boot to the alimentary canal of yours truly. Before we take a look at this merciless smackdown, a technical note. The audiovisual digital transmission which took unconditional and non-transferable ownership of my fat mushy ass was a direct webcam upload. That being said, the audio and the visual don't really match up too well. No point to this one, nor YouTube can be held responsible for this. As you will see in a moment, it's all my fault. If you're a Jaguar Jones fan, prepare to see your favorite YouTuber get his ass handed to him. You and your little cowboy hat can't refute that at this current- Whoa, whoa, whoa! Take issue with my arguments all you want, but there's no dissing the Stetson! You can't get more self-centered than... Look at me in my cowboy hat. There's no dissing the Stetson! And yes, I can get way more self-centered than look at me in my totally badass Stetson. Watch and learn, my friend. Look at me, I'm not wearing a hat. Look at me, I've got a gay little flower growing out of my hat. Look at me, I'm in my birthday suit. <sighs> Ooh. Ah. Yeah. I'll give you a minute to try to drink that one off your mind. Not enough booze in the world, is there? Look at me in my stupid red and black dreadlocks! To the San Diego Bolts the Denver Ponies, and the little boys playing pirate out there in Oakland. You're going down! Wow. What a moronic, idiotic, self-centered, dumbass point of view you have. Well, I can't argue that. I go around thinking things like, rain is wet, pangolins are totally gay, eBay should allow me to sell my pubic hair, and the most interesting conversation is the discussion of the similarities between suppositories and dental floss. Let me tell you this. Everything you said can be reasonably answered. Let me get this straight. Everything that I have said can be reasonably answered. I've got an entire army of psychiatrists, psychologists, social workers, law enforcement officials, veterinarians, ex-wives, and very disturbed children who would beg to differ. Um, the bottom line is, for anything you said, you need, you have to, you have to, you have to give proof. You know what proof is? If you don't, before you make a video in response to this, or fucking even question this inside of your own and fucking retarded head, you really do need to look up the definition of proof. Let's see. Prude, prudence, proficiency, procreate. Ah, here we are. Proof. Now, anything said by a fat neurotic jackass in a totally badass Stetson sunglasses and bowling shirt sitting in front of a wall of RAM. What's next? And when you do, and you do decide to make a video in response to this, <sighs> give me that. You know, proof for real. Real goddamn proof. Goddamn proof. Wait, 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 wait. You want proof, real goddamn proof, or goddamn proof? Because those are totally different things. Not only is there real goddamn proof and goddamn proof, but you've got motherfucking proof, sautéed proof, lubricated proof, proof con queso, and plain old sour proof like mother used to make. 
And really, when it comes down to it, the bottom line, the necessities of life, we really are just like animals. Do we need computers? No. No, we don't. Do we need any of the technological advances that we have in this modern day system? Do we need it to survive? No, we don't. Do we mate like animals? Yes, there are some animals that we mate just the same. For example, you can't tell me that we don't mate. I mean, you know, we have divorce, we have cheating, we have all that stuff. Divorce and cheating aren't mating. Divorce and cheating are all about sex, and mating is about making babies. In some senses, the penguin is just like us. Penguins are nothing like people, you ramjet moron. Penguins are birds, like to swim, and look like nuns. People, on the other hand, are created in the image of God, don't like to swim, and are scared of clowns. And don't make a video saying I'm fucking stupid because I compared us to a penguin. You know what the fuck I'm saying, and if you do, it makes you fucking retarded. If only I had watched the entire video before I started making this one. Stupid, 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 stupid! Your religion, your God, is no different than any other God, period, point blank. If you disagree, prove it. Prove your God is superior than any other fucking God. This is my God. Are you seriously suggesting that a plush donkey with a giant Elvis is not superior in every way to any other God ever? When I say Thor, or Zeus, or Poseidon, what word comes to mind? Um, um, I, I want to say butt plug, but I don't think that's my mind. I think it's a voice in my head or something. Uh, uh. Think, 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 think. I, um, uh, oh, ah, uh, um, uh, wait, what, what, uh, oh. Uh, ooh, uh. Stop pressuring me! I have given you my soul! Leave me my thing! Okay, okay, um... Mythology? Is it mythology? If it is mythology, don't make a response video to this. If it is, you're fucking stupid. I can't do anything right. Stupid, 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 stupid. Now, the thing about that that makes me... I don't smile about this at all because it's a very serious thing and it blocks all humans from just going further than what we are now. The thing that blocks your mind is... You think beyond a shadow of a doubt that you're right. Yeah, gonna kinda have to go ahead and disagree with you there. The thing that is blocking my mind is not an insistence that I am right, but an overwhelming desire to be a 17th century Jewish housewife named Loretta. Atheists? We don't say, we are correct, period. Basically... I mean, I don't want to be a narcissistic fucking asshole upon my own beliefs with all the others and say we are correct. We're saying we're correct at the current state because, frankly, no religion, period, has proven or given anything that says that they are correct. So, Do you really expect anyone to believe that the Church of Latter-day Saints has not convinced you to wear magic underwear? You and your little cowboy hat can't refute that at this current moment. Once again, there's no dissing the Stetson!